day. Cheers to a new episode of my color coded juicing series. If you're new here, every juicing episode I share new recipes to inspire others to have fun with juicing. Don't take it too seriously and definitely don't stick to the same old green juicing recipes that we see on social media or on the menus at the very expensive juicing spots. Don't do it. Purchase your fruits, purchase your veggies at the store and juice them yourself. If you're not going to drink it right away, it's okay. Chuck it in the freezer. That's all you have to do. Have fun with it and that's what I do here. However, on this video, the concoctions I created are made of the juices that helped me to increase my iron levels last year. For those of you who follow my color coded juicing series and my meal prepping videos on the regular, you know I was shook when those iron levels came back low and I was like, there's no way I will accept the title as anemic. No way, Jose. So I made diet changes, not only in the foods that I was eating, but with the juices I was creating as well. Like, okay, let me think about what I was doing around this time versus this time. I get my blood drawn annually, so it wasn't hard for me to compare what changes I had made. So of course, I did more research and I saw what fruits were high in iron. I said, well, you know what? I could definitely consume more of those. I could consume more of these and that. And you know, here we are. Brand new year, iron levels were back up on point in December. Your girl went from that to this, okay? Now listen, I'm not saying that these are the only fruits that can increase your iron levels. Hell, these may not even work for you the way they work for me because you know, I'm no nutritionist, I'm not a physician, uh, I ain't your PCP, I'm not your RN, I'm not a neurologist. Not sure what that would have to do with anything here, but I ain't it, okay? I'm just sharing what helped my body in an effort to inspire and motivate the next person to want to take the time and effort to improve their own bodies. Now, before I name my starting five today, or is it starting four? Yeah, before I name my starting four today, I am more than sure well, actually, I'm very freaking positive because I remember the long list. I know there are many other fruits and veggies you could drink to increase your iron levels, but these are the fruits that Jazzy Baby loves to drink or eat every single day, okay? So again, do your research. I'll add the links to the articles that I followed. Choose your fruits from there, but these are my babies that I drink every single freaking day okay all in the mix so just enjoy the concoction so these are my starting five i keep saying five why do i want to say starting five starting four because you know ginger lemon and limes they're always in my juices because they are natural preservatives that help your juices last longer to my starting five. Oh, well, four i keep saying five because i have a red bell pepper I said that weird, huh? I have a red bell pepper that I forgot to juice, so five is in my head, but it ain't. So these are my starting four. Apples, of course. Now apples, they're high in iron and vitamin C. So that was just great for me because apples are my absolute favorite for sure, without a doubt, no questions at all. And it's also known for reversing anemia. Uh, anemia. Um, okay. Let me, I wasn't supposed to start on oranges, but uh, on apples, but see, I was supposed to start on oranges, but I wasn't supposed to start on apples, but y'all know apples are my favorite. They always have to go first. Anyhow, I was supposed to start. Oranges, high in vitamin C. I also have blood oranges, high in vitamin C. Now they do have the low iron content. However, vitamin C helps the body to absorb iron more. So. I was like, oh, well, duh, that's a no-brainer. I definitely need those. So even if you see something that's low in iron, we'll see what other contents are high in it because maybe that can help the body to absorb it. So I told you blood oranges, oranges, strawberries, they're high in iron. When I saw, cause y'all know how I feel about my strawberry juice. When I saw that on the list, I said, yup, let me just increase my strawberries, my strawberry consumption, cause that's gonna make me very excited. 
And that's my four. Oranges, blood oranges, strawberries, apples. Yeah, right there. Just like that. So those are my four. I was able to make one, two, three, four, five, six. No, five concoctions because two of them are the same. Oh yeah. Anyhow, enjoy the video. You'll see all the fruits that I, you know, cut and juice and everything. I am still enjoying the juicer. Not necessarily used to it being a salon juicer yet, but I have been taking the time to slice the fruits into smaller pieces. That does make the process seem less slow because when I was cutting them larger, you know, the juicer, it's already a slow juicer, so it's gonna take longer to, you know, chop down and juice bigger slices. So today, I took my good old time to slice thinly. Thinly, thinly, I did, and I honestly did see the difference for sure. So enjoy the juicing video, guys.
juicing series. I won't be trying these concoctions simply because I created them countless times. So I know they're bomb. I know they are. The recipes are already on the website. Go check them out. You're going to love it. If you make, you know, any changes or add anything yourself, definitely let me know. Don't leave me out, okay? If you have any questions, just drop them in the comments below or contact me directly, which will also be privately. I know a lot of you prefer that. You can contact me on xojrwellness.com slash contact. Also, yeah. did y'all peep my new bottle? Did you, did you, did you? I got tired. Because even when I juiced, when I was, you know, earlier in my recovery during my surgery, the, you know, my long bottles, they are heavy. I had to be super careful. So by the time the new bottles came, I was further into my recovery. And I said, you know what? I've had these sitting out and they're sitting in their box for about two and a half weeks now. I need to put them to you. So I absolutely did. And for my beginners, if you're brand new to juicing, trying to figure out what juicer you should purchase, don't know what fruits to juice, don't know what veggies to juice, you wanna just make it more of a habit, a part of your lifestyle, check out my intro to juicing video. And if you have any questions over there, just drop them down, let me know. Ciao. Okay, y'all gotta tell me, did, are you like happy that I went back to the intro juicing? Cause remember the last video, my last juicing episode, it's edited a different way because I didn't do this part. I didn't do this. So let me know. I felt like this was necessary to talk in because I'm talking about the increased iron levels and specifics, you know? So let me know if you prefer the other. I think I may do a mix because I, although I was like, what the hell when I was editing that other video, I also really dig it a lot because I was able to do it really quick and was like, boop, 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 boom, you know? what I'm saying. Anyhow, I'm really gone. Y'all know how I get at the end, just pew. Uh, don't know where I'm going. I, I leave my kitchen this way. <laughs>